What's the book called, Veronica? It's called If I Had a Nightingale. Written and illustrated and by? Al King. <laughs> This book is dedicated to Christopher and Chloe. If I had a crocodile, I'll flip him on his back, away from my other pets in case he crept a snack. Want to show the picture? And here's the picture of his crocodile. And there's all his other Look pets. It. And there's the other crocodile, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll bet I could make him fall asleep if I gently rub his belly. The problem is, I might end up as reptile vermicelli. If I had a kangaroo, we'll jump on me. We go jumping on my bed. I'll day long for 10 years through, no matter what mom says. There's the kangaroo jumping on the bed. And the mother like, no, don't jump on the bed. Don't do that, jump on the bed. If we got caught, he dropped me into his gigantic pocket. I'd find a warm and cozy spot, then close the door and lock it. Dinosaur, I'd make him sit up straight. I'd teach him how to hold his fork and not to lick his plate. I w he wouldn't burp or smack his lips or spit out his Brussels sprouts. But if he drooled or slurped his soup, then dessert he'd do without. If I had a nightingale, it would sing under the stars. Songs so strong they might be heard on Jupiter or Mars. The notes would be so beautiful. They'd make you want to weep, and imagine you're in heaven as you're drifting off to sleep. Wait. I love you. <laughs>